Welcome to LearnComputerScienceOnline.com, and in this video, we are going to discuss, Computer System Bus Width. The computer system consists of, number of internal, and external components. These components are physically interconnected, and communicate with each other, through a network of wires, running across the computer system. These wires connecting the internal components are referred as computer buses. The computer buses are essential to the functioning of the computer system. The size of a bus can be measured, in terms of its bus width. The bus width is an important performance parameter because, it determines, how much data in terms of bits, can be transmitted, at one time. The larger system bus width, more data will be transferred which significantly improves the microprocessor performance. Let us consider one example. A 64-bit computer bus has 64 parallel cables and therefore it can transmit 64 bits of data at a time. Whereas a 32-bit bus has 32 wires and therefore it can transmit 32 bits of data at a time. We can compare the computer bus width with the number of lanes available on the highway. The road with more number of lanes can carry more volume of traffic. Similarly, a computer with a higher number of buses can carry more data for increased performance. Let us now summarize the computer bus width is number of bits transmitted in single operation. In other words, larger the bus width, better will be the computer's processor performance. That brings to the end of this tutorial on what is a computer bus width. Please visit our website www.learncomputerscienceonline.com to learn computer science online. If you have liked this video, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing to this channel. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon with another computer science tutorial.